Straight up, I normally don't use a case on my phone. I'm not clumsy in that way and I want to appreciate the build quality of the device I'm using. But I understand that a lot of people aren't like that and for those, this may just be the most versatile and indestructible phone case out there. When Rhino Shield reached out to me to test their phone cases, I just couldn't say no because I've seen so many incredible tests with them. But before I toss my phone to the ground myself, let's talk about the cases in general. They have mod cases that you can customize how you want, but those are only available for iPhones, so I can't say anything to those. There are high quality screen protectors as well. But I can personally talk about my experience with their crash guard bumpers and solid suit cases. Their cases are made of BPA free plastic, so they're not chemically hazardous, but they're still very strong and flexible. Part of that is the honeycomb mesh structure inside the case that helps spread out the impact energy more evenly. Rhinoshield says that their cases withstand up to 11 feet, which is 3.3 meters of drop height. But I have seen these things being dropped out of helicopters as well. All the buttons are nice and clicky, and on the OnePlus phone I have here, they have even accounted for the alert slider. The bumper case of course preserves more of the aesthetic of your phone, but it doesn't give you the same level of protection as one of the full solid suit cases. Even if the ridges on both sides should give some protection to the glass. And the cases have another advantage over the bumper, the ability to attach lenses. With an adapter you can quickly and securely attach one of their add-on lenses like this macro and wide-angle combo lens. You can either get more in the shot with a 0.6x wide angle, about the same as a dedicated wide angle camera on some phones, so if you don't have a phone with that feature, this is a great substitute. And if you screw off the front part, you get a macro lens with which you can get really close to subjects for some truly stunning results. Bear in mind though that this basically only makes the focus distance of your phone a lot smaller, it's not a zoom lens. So I think that's enough feature talk for now, let's do some drops. I used the full case for this and not just the bumper because I really didn't want to risk anything, but after a while I lost my concerns that were still there. A phone is expensive after all, but the case protects it well. After about 25 drops from heights between 1 and 2 meters, even through the phone at some points, the only visible damage are some substantial scuffs on the case's corners. Without the case, the phone would have definitely been dead long ago. I did not want to drop it from a roof, but I think that I was comfortable with doing this to my phone already says something. And if you want proof for the helicopter, I'll link that below. Overall, I'm really impressed at what the cases offer in terms of protection and also versatility. The add-on lenses really produce some high quality perspectives. Because I really like the cases, I would appreciate it though if they made them for more phones. For now, if you don't have an iPhone, Galaxy, Pixel or OnePlus device, you're basically out of luck. But don't just take my word for everything that I just said. Because I don't have a use for a pile of phone cases, you can win all of the stuff that Rhino Shield sent me. You know the drill, you click the link in the video description, complete some entries and you're done. All of the exact details and conditions are also in the video description below. Thanks to Rhino Shield for sending me all of the cases, lenses and screen protectors to try out. But because they let me keep them and because I also get a commission if you buy cases and other stuff through the links in the video description, I have to declare this video as advertisement for legal reasons, but that doesn't change the fact that all of my opinions are still my own and that I didn't receive any direct compensation for this video. If you enjoyed it, you know which buttons to press and don't forget to press that follow button on Twitter. I'm Brian, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.